Greetings, patrons. Uh, thank you guys so much for all of your support. I wanted to provide you a couple of quick updates and also thank you guys in your own private videos. So thank you guys for all of the support. Um, the new print for the month, um, let's just say it can be whatever you want. So if you find me at Anime Weekend Atlanta at booth 1109 uh, and it's September 25th through 27th of 2015, you can pick out any print you want for my booth and I'll give it to you for free. So anyways, I wanted to show you guys some of the really cool stuff that I I've been able to upgrade or get thanks to all of your support. Um, first, this bad boy. This is a Blue Yeti microphone and it is amazing. Basically it has a lot of different settings on the back and I pretty much only use the setting that lets me talk into it like directly from the front but the audio quality that I've gotten from that compared to my headset that I was using is so much better. It's so much clearer and I've noticed that some of you on Twitch like this a lot better and you can really tell the difference of quality on my videos. So thank you guys so much for helping me do that. That was one of the first things that I went out and took care of. Um, the other thing is the webcam. So you notice that I'm not like shaky camming with my camera anymore if you look at some of my YouTube videos. Um, this is a much higher quality than my camera phone was, but it's still not quite where I want it to be So I think I'm gonna save up a little bit and then eventually get a really nice camera early next year So I want to let you guys know that that's coming down the road And then that's when I'm gonna start doing a lot more of the videos where I'm like recording myself draw like on actual paper and stuff <laughs> Um, so I wanted to let you guys know that that's on the horizon and thanks to all of your support I am able to do that um I got a new headset, partially thanks to your support, partially because of my husband, but this is my pretty headset. Um, it glows and it changes colors, and honestly, it really doesn't have that great of sound quality, but I freaking love it because it's adorable and it's pink. So, and it has a microphone, so it's got a little hidden microphone here, but the microphone quality is really, really bad. Uh, but the nice thing is, is that this is like really comfy. So like when I put it on, it like doesn't push my earrings up into my head, which is really nice. So I also like that it has this little guy on the end so I can actually like adjust my volume without having to like blindly like, you know, mess around with this. So this is really cool. So thank you guys. This is really awesome and it's really helped me out a lot. And I always get a lot of compliments on it um, in messages about the cute headset. So thank you guys. Really appreciate it. And the last one I can't really show you. Maybe you can hear it. Um, maybe I can. I'm going to try to squeeze this out of here. So I use a really small external hard drive. It's like this big and it is one terabyte. It's called My Passport and it is by, I forget, Western Digital. It's got a WD on it. But anyways, um, I can't show you one side of this because well, I kind of can. I'm covering up my phone number. Um, thanks you guys. I was able to pick this up. Um, and this is basically a little carrying case, kind of like a DS case, but for my external hard drive, because I was always worried about it when I travel to conventions because I have to put it in bags and stuff. And then when I'm putting it in like my laptop bag, I don't feel that it's very safe. One, because my laptop bag sucks. Um, I really hate my laptop bag. <laughs> That's on my list of upgradable items. So I, I picked up this thing. I wrote my number out in case someone finds it at a con. And look, it's like all padded and stuff. It's got like this little flap so I can put other like cords and stuff in here and it came with these little things, these doohickeys that I can use to clip on here and like, actually I'm, I'm making sure I keep my phone number covered up. Um, but it's really padded and really nice so now I don't have to worry about my um, external hard drive like getting completely ruined if the cat like runs through and knocks it off and stuff. Um, so thank you guys very much for this. It was pretty inexpensive, um, and I was really happy to be able to pick it up thanks to all of your support. So thank you guys. This is really awesome, and I appreciate it. Um, the other thing that I was able to get is something that you can't see. Um, you can't touch it. It is a, an extra copy of Manga Studio Pro 5. Yeah, Pro 5. And I got that one for my laptop, and I actually was able to purchase that back for the April. Yeah, a panel I did in April or May, I had that, um, but I was actually able to get that. I got on sale for like 17 bucks, which was awesome, because um, Smith My Pro Pro does some really awesome uh, sales and stuff. So I was able to pick that up thanks to you guys also. So now I'm able to 
um, show people the, the program that I actually work in when I do panels now that I've changed that which happened in the, at the end of 2014. So now I'm able to actually share with them Manga Studio Pro 5 and Photoshop and show them comparisons of basically how each one works and the pros and cons of each program as well as like what the line art looks like um, you know and how how slick the line art is in Manga Studio Pro 5. So I now have two copies of it one for my um, desktop and one for my laptop so thank you guys very much for helping me um, you know enabling me to get that and enabling me to help other artists you know figure out things so that they don't have to do as much trial and error as I've had to do hopefully um, because there's still a level of trial and error with this kind of business but um, thank you guys I really appreciate it and um, I hope that you are enjoying a lot of the content that I'm putting out here um, I appreciate also all the comments that you guys have made on uh, pros and cons which is going to be coming out in November of this year so I'm finishing up some of the scripting I'm finishing up some of the character designs and character art I want to have a um, a promotional poster that I do for it that'll have um, all the characters on it which is gonna be a lot of characters um, and I wanted to let you guys know I'm kind of doing it in a working you might know it as Wagnaria because um, that's the name it was released under over here but I'm kind of doing it in like a working meets Denki guy meets Genshiken kind of way so it's going to be you know like really shorts um, really quick shorts that focus on a variety of characters with a variety of interests with overlapping plot lines but a lot of slapstick humor a lot of humor because I know especially you Brian Rodriguez said that you know you're, you're down for this but it's got to have the humor so I'm gonna make sure that it has the humor in it so that you guys want to see so if you keep commenting and you keep sending me your support um, and you keep you know letting me know what you guys want to see from pros and cons over the next year because that's how long it's gonna run I will do my best to incorporate everything that you guys want and every little bit of feedback that you give me for pros and cons so thank you again for all the support from the bottom of my heart it means the world to me and you guys are awesome and I really appreciate you so anyways um, thank you so much I just want to make a really quick video to say thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you so Thanks again. I hope I'll see you guys at Anime Weekend Atlanta, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.